Hello everyone. You are listening to this audiobook on channel Voice of Purpose by NSS IIT Bombay. If a blind person gained sight, could they recognize objects previously touched? In 1688, an Irish polymath named William Molyneux wrote an English philosopher John Locke a letter in which he posed a vexing question. Could a blind person upon suddenly gaining an ability to see recognize an object by see what he would previously know by feel in easy words he asked if a blind person knows a cube or a square by touch will he after gaining sight be able to acknowledge what is what this was a twisted question because an answer yes or no would cover many prospects the interrelation of different senses or maybe their independence from one another an affirmative answer to this question might have also pointed to an altogether different way in which a person knows the world let's check out what enthusiast found out after diving deep into debates discussion and research it for a long time people stuck to the negation of the problem However, things began to turn in late 19th-20th century. In 2003, a program was set out in India in cooperation with a charity eye hospital in New Delhi. Among the many patients, five were chosen, four boys and one girl, aged 8 to 17, who met the criteria for surgery that would almost instantly take them from total blindness to fully seeing. Once bandages were removed, researchers had to first be sure that the volunteer could see well once it was ensured then they took the critical test in which the children first felt an object and then tried to distinguish visually between that same object and a similar one the result were barely better than if they had guessed the answer to molinex question then appears to be no the data blind people gather tactically that allows them to identify a cup and a vase and to tell them apart is not accessible through vision at least not at first however the interesting part comes in the rapidity in which this inability was escaped within about a week it was done which is surely fast it's a great story says alvaro pascual leon a neurologist and neuroscientist at Harvard Medical School in Boston the change in the children's ability to integrate touch and vision happens too fast to be explained by major rewiring in the brain pascal yon says even though they grew up recognizing objects by touch they needed only a little bit of visual experience to learn to translate between two senses they are not starting from zero he says a connection had also been verified between the two senses of touch and sight in the sighted people through a test done to analyze brain activity without looking the subject would describe object they could only examine with their hands despite being blindfolded their visual areas were very active it's as if they translated tactile sensation into visual terms it is clearly the sign of integration of two senses molinex's question has undergone various stages of development both as a mental exercise and as an experimental paradigm garnering a variety of both affirmative and negative replies during three centuries of debate and deliberation should we answer molinex's question with no as was the common response of 18th century or yes as some philosophers today claim a philosopher's news molinex question continues to aspire insight and direct understanding about the mind and its content and the answer is we still don't know so hope you guys had fun Please like, share and subscribe to this channel for more interesting audiobooks.